Hi, my name is Genevieve. I'm with the Noise Museum of Art of Stockton University, and welcome to Noise Art at Home. Today, I'll be showing you how to paint a flower pot inspired by a famous blue painting. The materials you will need for this project are a terracotta flower pot, clear acrylic sealer, paint brushes, and acrylic or craft paint. The art we will be creating today is inspired by the work of French painter Claude Monet. Claude Monet once said, I have come back to things that are impossible to do. Water with weeds waving in the depths. Apart from painting and gardening, I am good for nothing. My greatest masterpiece is my garden. In this project, you will paint Monet's blue water lilies on a flower pot for your garden. Let's get started. First, prime the flower pot with an even layer of white paint. Monet was thought to have primed his canvases with lead white paint. Let this dry. Now it's time to prepare your Monet inspired color palette. Monet used oil paint, but we will be using acrylic or craft paint. Because of using different paint, colors may not match perfectly. Mix cobalt blue with different amounts of white and apply it to the flower pot in broad, expressive brush strokes. Then, do the same with French ultramarine blue. From a scientific color analysis of color samples taken from Monet's work, a significant amount of cobalt blue was found. Generally, this pigment was used most in his Water Lily series and by other Impressionists. Monet also used French ultramarine blue, another blue pigment he used in the absence of cobalt blue. Remember, it's okay to not cover all of the white face coat. In Blue Water Lilies, Monet didn't paint to the edges of the canvas. Also, use this photo as reference while you are reproducing your own Monet painting. The next colors are Viridian Green and Emerald Green. Mix a light green color for the lily pads. Paint brush strokes in a circular motion. Make sure you don't have too much paint on your brush. The lily pads should blend and have soft edges. Mix a dark green for the reflection of the vertical leaves of the willow trees. Next, there is a darker muted pigment surrounding the water lilies. Finally, use white and yellow for the lily flowers. Paint with loose, blended brush strokes to achieve an impressionist feel. Let the paint sit and dry. Most importantly, terracotta is porous and absorbs moisture. Spray a clear acrylic sealer around the exterior of your flower pot. This will help your painting to last longer and protect it from the outdoors. Let's see what you painted. Share your artwork with us by using the hashtag noiseartathome on social media. Thanks for watching.